Whoa. Welcome to the charge. I'm Sir Franklin, and we're taking to the field today with Night Reception. This is a short horror game, and I thought we needed a little break from some of the longer playthroughs we were doing. This one should be quick, and it already looks kind of interesting. I'm glad you're here, and if you're not already, please consider hanging out in the channel, subscribing, commenting, whatever you'd like to do. I'd love to hear from you. That being said, let's ride. Uh, it was just another regular shift for me. You know, checking guests in, finding their rooms, and making sure they were settled. Do I... Do I click it? Oh, there you go. Nothing out of the ordinary. Except, I wasn't in the best mood that night. I had a fight with my girlfriend before heading... Before heading, she was upset. Before heading out, she was upset, saying I work too much and never have time for us. Honestly, it felt just like another argument. I figured once the night ended, I'd smooth things over. As usual, the guest arrived, and I did my job. Greet them, pull up their reservation, and guide them to their rooms. Simple, right? But that night, there was something different in the air. Maybe it was just me, but... Greet them, pull up the reservation, and guide them to their rooms. Maybe it was just me, but I couldn't shake the feeling that something wasn't quite right, and it turns out, I wasn't wrong. Okay, so we greet them, pull up the reservation, guide them to their rooms. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, cool. Do we have feet? Feet check. No feet. That is okay. Yeah, I'm not going out there. Oh. Oh. I used to ball back in my day. Yep. Just like the pros. Uh oh, there's somebody here. There's somebody here. What do I do? What do I do? I'm scared. I can't. Okay, get to safety. That's okay. Uh, whoa. Good evening. The name's Victor. I booked a room for the night. Of course, Mr. Vi oh, sorry, it's us. Of course, Mr. Victor, follow me. I'll show you to your room. Thanks. Been traveling all day. I hope the room's comfortable. All right. Victor, room number six, that does match him. Okay. Do we have, like, do we need a key or anything? Or... Oh. Whoa, whoa, hey. Oh, oh, okay. What? Interesting. All right, so room number six. I... Following a little closely. Oh, we have a playground. It's family friendly. Very cool. All right. So it's three, four, five, six. Should be right here. Dude. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. Uh... Why is it green? Interesting. Here we are. Oh, here we are, Mr. Victor. If you need anything or have any complaints, feel free to call the front desk. Thanks, I'll let you know if I need anything. Appreciate it. Okie dokie. It's a little, a little dark out here, isn't it? Why is that open? Is that a door? Nope, that's the AC. What is that? Oh, it's a trash can. Kind of nice to see what all's here. Don't like that you're just open. Can we... Nope, can't go through there either. What's over here? Nothing at all. Good. Nope. Oh. All right, 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 all right. I want to go where it's safe. Where it's safe. <laughs> they come in so fast, and I don't know if they're friendly or not. All right. Oh. Hi, I have a reservation under Evelyn. Certainly, Evelyn. I'll take you to your room. Follow me, please. Thanks. It's a bit late, isn't it? This place feels so quiet. Well, what do you got? Um, how do I spell Evelyn? Is that it? You are room number one. Gotcha. Follow me. And you'll be in a generic motel room right here. Uh, room one, you are down this way, Evelyn. All right in here. Just gonna check and make sure your room's safe. 
I guess it doesn't let us go into the bathroom, so we should be all set. There you go. Here's your room, Evelyn. Oh, sorry. If you need anything or have any issues, just call the front desk. Thank you. I'll keep that in mind. The room seems nice. You're darn tootin' rootin' shootin' scootin' it is. The nicest motel rooms ever. It's so dark. What's this? Okay. Okay, before somebody... Alright, before somebody else comes up, what's in here? We haven't really had a chance to... Look, we have knives... Why won't this open? Alright, I'm sure somebody's in there. Oh, hello, I'm sorry, ma'am. Hey, name's Scarlet. I have a reservation, right? Yes, Scarlet. Let me show you to your room. Great, lead the way. This place is kind of creepy, don't you think? Well, everybody keeps seeming to say it, so yes. Okay, Scarlet, you were room number 12. That does... Seem to match. So twelve, I guess, will be upstairs. Whoa, the little the little head duck as she came over, a little scary. All right, we can't really run, can we? What's back there? Should we explore that later? It might actually be faster if we go up this way. I think I'd want to be on the second floor, although I don't know how much it really matters in this case. Again. A little courtesy check just to make sure everything's good. All righty, Scarlet. This is your room, Scarlet. If you have any requests or concerns, feel free to call the front desk. Got it. Let's hope I don't need to. Thanks. All right. Take it easy. Okay, we have not explored behind here yet. I'm a little curious. The curiosity's coming out. We're checking it out, seeing what's around. A whole lot of nothing. Nice. I don't like that there's kind of that open space, though. It makes me wonder why we might need that later. So what, we've got three people sitting here. I better water the plants until the new customers arrive. All right. Interesting. Love it all. Do I water, like, the hedges? or No? Okay. Okay. Do we have other plants? Oh, I thought I heard something. Okay. I guess that's it. I don't know where, like, other plants are. Oh. Duh. What lovely plants we have. Is that it? I don't like that we can't open those doors. I don't know what's in there. Alrighty. I don't see any other plants. Do I just... Is that the swing set? All right. Sounds like none of my business. Is that a person? What is that? Whoa. Hey, what are you doing here? It's the middle of the night. Aren't you a little too old to be playing on a swing? Old? Who's counting the years anymore? Time stops here, at this place. Uh, what do you mean? Shouldn't you be in your room, or... home? Home? I've been waiting here, watching. You've noticed it too, haven't you? Noticed what? You're, you're not making any sense. You'll see, soon enough. We all do, eventually. What are you talking about? What, what will I see? They always come when the light goes out. gonna go back in here. Nice little photo. 
I don't know who that man is. We have two more rooms left. Oh, I thought I saw something out there. He's still there? Oh, he's gone. Cool. <laughs> All right. Hey, how's it going? Let's get you checked in. Whoa. Hi, I'm Lydia. Can you take me to my room, please? Uh, of course, Lydia. I'll, I'll take you there right now. Follow me. Thank you. I just... I need to get settled quickly. Okay. A little creepy. Lydia. Room number 10. Gotcha. You are going to kill me, aren't you? All right. How close do they get? Okay, so they pause right about there. I do like how they do the models. It's creepy. It's unsettling. There you go. All right, let's do your room check. All right, Lydia, here you are. Here's your room, Lydia. If you need anything or have any problems, just call us. Thank you. I, I will. She's like, okay, yeah. Yeah. Sure. Now, I wonder what that guy meant. Who is they? Why do they show up when the lights turn out? Are they here to kill us? Is there something behind us? What? Love it. Security cameras that do not work. All right, should be our final customer, and I'm hoping that this one's not a killer. But everybody keeps saying stuff's weird about this place. Evening, the name's Damien. I have a room reserved near room 11. Oh, hold on. I would like to apologize. I realize I, uh, I had to stop the video for a second because I, I had uh, a package delivered to my front door. I come back, and um, I start to play the rest of the game. We... I realized I wasn't recording. Here's what you need to get caught up on. We're delivering food to the people. Um, we have burgers and stuff for them. We only need to deliver Damien's meal. But he had the door open when we were delivering it to Lydia, the woman upstairs. So I think he's stalking her. Another creepy thing is that Ronald McDonald is delivering our meals. Um, so they made it and wheeled it in on this, I guess, mobile hibachi McGriddle kind of thing. McGriddle. Oh, God. So now we're going to go deliver our last meal of the evening. And this head just follows us everywhere. Last one. Let's see if Damien's done anything sinister. Here's your dinner, Damien. Appreciate it. Took you long enough. Sorry for the wait. Anything else you need? Not for now, but I'll let you know. What a lovely fella. What a what a joy to be around. Creepy and mean. Perfect combo. Alright, Ronald. Put it on my tab. Alright, I've delivered all the meals. Great, how did it go? Any issues? Not really, but one of the guests said they thought someone knocked on their door earlier. It wasn't me. Hmm, could have been another guest. These places can play tricks on your mind at night. Yeah, maybe. Anyways, thanks for the quick service. I'll be glad when my shift's over. I hear you. I got one more round of deliveries, and I'm out of here, too. Hang in there. Will do. Have a good night. You, too. Stay safe out here. That's weird that I get along with the clown. All right. Guess we just go back in here for now. Oh, phooey. Oh, the generator's out back. What? What is that? Okay, they said they come out at night. That guy earlier. Weird. Maybe that's what he meant. Creepy things.
Whoa, hello. Mr. Davis, what are you doing here? I didn't expect to see you. You actually scared me for a second. Oh, sorry about that. I didn't mean to. I'm staying in room three tonight, just checking in on things after the power went out. Right, I forgot you were staying here. Uh, everything's fine now. I just had to reset the breakers. Good, good. I was worried some more serious happened. The power can be tricky sometimes. Yeah, it's all sorted now. Well, since you're here, the reception desk looks a bit messy, don't you think? Could you tidy it up before the guests start noticing? Sure, I'll take care of it right now. Thanks, I'll head back to my room. Let me know if anything else goes wrong. Oh, that's a beard. I thought it was like Cheetos or something. Okay, guess we're gonna go tidy up the desk. What? What is that? What are these... When did these cobwebs get here? Is time passing? I don't know how to tidy up the desk. Do I have to get cleaning supplies? Look, you're still here. Seriously, what are you? Okay. Weird. Oh. Alright. Yeah. No idea what that is. Okay. I guess we can't really do anything about it. We are fast. Is there anything over here that I might have missed? Oh, nope. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Your call is very important to us. Hold on. Oh, no. I dropped the... Okay. I might have just screwed that up. Hello? Is this a reception? I'm Scarlet Room 12. Listen, something strange just happened. While the power's out, someone tried to open my door. I thought it was you, but I didn't see anyone when I checked. That's unsettling. I'm really sorry about that. I'll come up right away and take a look. Okay, thank you, but please hurry. I feel really uneasy. Was it Damien? Um, no. We're not going to do that. We're going to go check on them immediately. I feel like that's a trick. So they can go over there. Oh, is it going to make us answer first? Okay. Well, I suppose that's just what we'll have to do. Oh, he's still chilling. All right. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, who is this? Is this some kind of a joke? If you're messing with me, stop now. Say something. Who are you? If you don't stop, I'm calling the police. This isn't funny anymore. The purple thing. I'm still thrown off. I'm not really sure what's going on. Okay, so he's still hanging out there. Maybe he's our culprit. And he was just making sure that he hadn't gotten caught. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Scarlet, open the door. Something wrong. I can't hear you. All right, I'm going to force it open. Uh-oh. Hold on. Let's check the bathroom first. This has gone too far. I can't handle this anymore. Gotta go to the reception call the police right away. Yikes. This, how could this be here? Maybe it'll come in handy, but I hope I don't have to use it. How would I... Why would I? Creepy. I guess... We're not supposed to help anybody, we're just supposed to go to the reception. The guy's still there. Okay. Emergency service, what's going on? Someone's in one of the rooms, a woman is screaming for help, I think she's in danger. Where are you right now? I'm at the reception of a motel, someone broke into her room, she's calling for help. Stay calm, we're sending officers now. What a joy. Did I... Did he get me? What? What just happened? No! Wow, we have to do all this over again? 
All right, well, now you guys get to see what happens. Yes, been through this before. We're going to speed through this part. Oh, joy. See, this is when it would be nice to be able to sprint. To do this all over again. We're getting there, we're getting there, we're getting there, we're getting there. Come on. Come on. Come on. Hey, Victor, take your dinner, please. Take your dinner. Thank you. I don't know where that dude came out with that knife. Was that Damien, the, the dude, the creepy guy? I'm not sure. And then Mr. Davies or Davis, whatever his name is, he said he's staying in room three. So check this out. His door's going to be open. There you go, Lydia. Yep, yep, yep. I'm also surprised we can't carry more than one meal at a time. I guess they're on trays and you want to be careful going up the stairs. So that's, you know what, that's fair. I thought I clicked F fast enough. Maybe I'm supposed to hold it? No. Come on. There you go. All right, Damien, you creepy fella. I think it is him. Appreciate it taking long. I'm sorry, I think I'll see you now, but I'll let you know. What a lovely, lovely, distinguished gentleman. We're going back down to Ronald McDonald to grab the food to get it to Scarlet, I believe. What are the names? There's Evelyn, Scarlet, Lydia, Damien, Victor. Boom. And then Davies or Davis or whatever his name is. All right, last one, my guy, my dude. Need to drop the soft Scarlet. Who might be in danger because we find blood later? Come on, almost there. There we go. Yep. Okay. All right, pal. Yep. Have a good one, bud. And the power turns out any second now. I'm just going to let it do its thing. We'll just hang out, I suppose. Weird, I thought it was thought it was supposed to. Maybe I'm wrong. There it is. The purple thing. Very odd. Mr. Davis. Okay, it is Davis. The fellow with the macaroni beard. Okay. I'll get right back on it. It's weird that that all is messy now. Oh, no. Oh, there it is. Okay. Good. Good. I like it's a little tap. It's like, boop. And then that one. And that should be it. Nice. Yeah, and then we had Scarlet in there. Yep, 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 yep. And then we gotta go back. 
Hello, who is this? Nobody seems to be talking to me. A little rude. Okay. All that's done. Davis is still chilling over there. And then she won't open the door. Is that it? That's what it is. Yeah, yeah, we had to walk back that way. So somebody's in there. We need to go call the police. And then we get attacked by a knife-wielding fella. It might be Mr. Davis that attacks us, actually. Not sure. What's going on? There's a woman who's screaming. Here's the info. Help me out. Dang. We knew it's finally over. I managed to survive, but Scarlet is still missing. The police will handle the rest now. I don't know what really happened tonight, but I know I'll never forget it. This place will always remind me of the fear, the danger, and how close I came to losing everything. Now I just want to leave this nightmare behind. Eh, alright. It was good. Um, not, not bad. It was fun. Quick one. Uh, I like the style. You know, you had a couple things you kind of had your eye on. I would have liked maybe more of, um, a narrative to the ending on, like, why we were getting attacked by somebody. Uh, but also, you know, a couple of quick little scares, fun atmosphere. So it was good. That's about it. Short, sweet game, and I'm glad you were here for it. If you're not already, I would ask that you support the channel. Let me know what you thought about this game in the comments, or like it, or whatever you want to do. But join the community. Be a part of it. It's fun. I want to thank you for joining the charge today, though, and I will see you on the next battlefield. Until then.